Now I've built myself a small decked area here in preparation for a French Cheek video. And the boards themselves are gonna be painted of course. However, the screws that are holding these planks to the beams below are countersunk just below the surface here. Now what we don't wanna do is when we're painting these, for the water to pocket in there and start penetrating through. So I'm gonna be using 3C's flexible paintable external wood filler to fill them holes, gently sand them down, and then paint over them, and they're gonna look fantastic. It's really easy to apply. You're gonna need a silicone gum. Cut the nozzle at 45 degrees, squeeze the trigger, and put a small amount of filler directly over the top of the hole. Start to push this in using a small scraper. The nature of these boards is a non-slip tread, so you find there's grooves standing proud. The screws are actually countersunk lower down in there, so the filler can be easily wiped to create the shape of the inside of the board. Then you can always wipe it off with the cloth. I also had a couple of splits in the timber. So again, I filled these with my 3C's paintable filler, smoothed this off with my finger, and gave it a quick wipe down with the damp cloth. Left this to dry overnight, give it a quick sanding, and then it was ready to paint. I'm using French Cheeks Alfresco paint. The colors Victory Lane. Once the paint's completely dry, a minimum of two coats will be required, but I prefer to give it free for a stronger, longer lasting finish. So that's how you prepare and paint your decking. For more 60 second tips, subscribe to our YouTube channel. Mr. and Mrs. DIY.